For Montreal Canadiens, everything is up to the last day of season. We usually discuss playoffs, but as every Habs fan knows, 2022-23 represents race to the bottom, and a race towards improved 2023 draft lottery odds, including chance to pick phenomenal Connor Bedard. The Canadians are trailing their 44th regulation loss of the year, on Wednesday night, with an easy 4-2 win by the New York Islanders. The game was important for two reasons not only did Canadians avoid scoring points in standings and thus maintaining their fifth worst position in standings, it also meant that Islanders would qualify for playoffs, beating Sidney Crosby. And then there were two with 81 games in the books, both Canadians and Coyotes compete to finish in the last five. Currently, the Canadians have earned just 68 points and placed 28th overall. They have an 8.5% chance of winning the 2023 draft lottery, and thereby securing Bedard's rights. They also have an 8.5% chance of winning the second draft lottery. The Jackals scored 69 points, giving them a 7.5% chance of winning both lotteries. Montreal will face league leaders Boston Bruins in final game of season, while Coyotes will play against Vancouver Canucks. Habs angle the Canadians have won three of their last ten games, but you'd have a hard time claiming they're the favorites to play against the Bruins. Boston is not only a good team, but also a historically remarkable team, with 133 points in the standings. It's a home game for Canadians, but that doesn't mean much given the Bruins have an away record of 30-8-2 this season compared to Canadians' 17 games won at Bell Centre. Linus Ulmark, who should have easily flown into a Vezina Cup this season, will not play for the Bruins as he hasn't made a trip to Montreal. However, Bruins backup Jeremy Swayman is also one of the best goalkeepers in the league, as evidenced by his 0.922 save percentage this season. The Bruins are expected to rest a few star players, but when you consider that the Canadians keep roughly half of their roster on injured reserve, statistically speaking, this should be an easy win for Boston, which has won 9 of their last 10 games, including 7 wins in a row. It's also worth noting that the Bruins have won both of their matches against the Canadians this season, with both matches ending 4-2 in favor of Boston. Coyote angle the Coyotes will face Canucks in the final episode of season, who have done a great job improving their overall game level. Fortunately for Canadians fans, the game will be played in Arizona, meaning the Coyotes will likely improve their healthy home record of 21-15 for this season.